Hello everyone, a good news. Indian based company Vocard has developed an antibiotic combination which is used to treat infections caused by superbugs. Now what are these superbugs sir? See people get infections because of bacteria. Now to treat bacterial infection we use antibiotics. Now when we overuse these antibiotics the bacteria will develop resistance towards antibiotics. That means even if you use antibiotics bacteria will not die. The infection will be there. So such kind of bacteria which has developed resistance to many antibiotics are called as superbugs. Now superbugs are very dangerous because you cannot use any antibiotic to treat that infection. But Vocard has come up with a combination which can be used to treat infections caused by these superbugs. The combination, the drug is called as WCK522. It contains two drugs, one cefepime and zidbactam. Now cefepime is a fourth generation cephalosporin whereas zidbactam has got three different actions. One, it inhibits bacterial beta-lactamase enzyme. Second one, it has got antibacterial properties. Third one, it increases the binding of drug with bacteria. And this combination has shown prominent results. Vocard has come up with this combination and the drug is in clinical trials. See, in order to get approved, the drug has to undergo clinical trials. Phase 1, Phase 2, Phase 3. Once it finishes Phase 3, it gets into the market. But the drug is still in Phase 3 clinical trials. It is not completed yet. Still, it has been used for the three times. In last September, it is used in Lucknow and then in Chennai and recently in Hyderabad on compassionate grounds. Understand this, even though it is not approved, on compassionate grounds, they will get permission to use these drugs on people. Recently in Hyderabad, an 18-year-old 18, 18 man was suffering with T-cell leukemia, a kind of cancer. And he has got an infection caused by Pseudomonas aeruginosa. And doctors could not use any antibiotic because it has developed resistance to most of the antibiotics. Then doctors took permission on compassionate ground and used this combination, cefepime and zidbactam. Miraculously, the drug has shown very promising result and the young man is recovered from all the infection. So this is the good news. And Indian doctors are contemplating to get emergency use authorization. Understand this one. See, when, when people has got COVID infection, vaccines got approved in a hurried way. Usually, it takes at least 10 to 12 years to get approval for a drug or vaccine to get into the market. But during emergencies, we can apply for a process called as emergency use authorization. In emergencies, you can, you can speed up the process. Instead of taking 10 to 12 years, it will get approved in two years. And for that kind of approval, doctors are trying for this combination because it has shown very promising results. This is a good news. I hope this is useful. Thank you.